start with Michigan football. As if these guys haven't been in the news enough, their star quarterback, Devin Gardner, well, the season hasn't gone as they expected. They're staying three and four right now, and he's been anything but smooth this season. The hate's been real. So real, you asked Doug Chapman. Take a look about this when he was asked about the hate, what he had to say. I've been called the N-word so many times this year. One guy told me I was the N-word and said, I know N-words can't play quarterback. And I was like, are we not past this? Say what you want about my skill, but come on. Now, Doug, it's unbelievable that we're sitting here at 2014, we got a black president, all the opportunities in the world, and yet still athletes, college athletes, got to deal with this. Are we not past this? I'm, I'm surprised he even responded. He's better than me. I just ignored the guy. But I figure like this, if we got a, a black quarterback starting at Notre Dame, your alma mater, an yeah. Irish Catholic institution, they can get over at Michigan. It's usually some guy that's so far removed from the program, probably never even attended college his entire life. So I wouldn't even worry about it if I was Devin Gardner. They say we live in a post-racial America. That's BS. You know, you've got people out here that are still very, very prejudiced. It's not cool anymore to be openly prejudiced. You can't walk yeah. around with a Klan suit on anymore. So people do it more now with social media. You can hide behind those platforms and say whatever well, here's you want. The, yeah, that's the most interesting thing is you, when you were at College of Marshall, when I was in Notre Dame, we didn't have to deal with Twitter. We didn't have to deal with that hate. I'm going to tell you this. If somebody called me the N-word on Twitter, I don't know how I'd respond. So I think the power to him for not getting caught up in the mix, saying something they shouldn't have said. But... How do you protect, if you're Michigan, your kid from being exposed to something like uh, this? You, you can't, unless you keep the guys off Twitter, and a lot of kids aren't going to do that. Is that a rule that you but, think coaches should implement? But, but if the guy calls me out and says black shouldn't play the position, I'd say, well, the reigning Heisman Trophy winner. Go ahead and pull up that full screen, as you mentioned. Is a black saying guy. Saying that black guys shouldn't yeah. be. There's a full there screen we have here that actually mentions all the quarterbacks, excuse me, not a full screen, a video, of some of these he, quarterbacks you're talking about. Pretty, There's Jameis Winston. Look pretty black to Dak me. Dak Prescott. Yeah. I mean, what do you want here? It's been all guys of color. That have performed right now. Marcus Mariota, he, he ain't black, he's but he's yeah, a man he of color. Yeah, he's something. If there's brown in it, then he's probably experienced I mean, some of the stuff that what, what color was a quarterback? What about? color was a quarterback that won a Super Bowl last year in the NFL? Russell Wilson. Black guy. I mean, so which he's kind of been in the news lately himself. Well, 